Welcome to 30 Day Reviews, where, as usual, I've been using the Pucket for at least 30 days. Actually, I've been using it for closer to about two months every time that I showered. Gibbs Grooming was so nice to send me the Pucket, which is now, as you can see, not much of a puck at all. It's more like a large wafer. However, when I first got this in the mail, it did come in the size of about a hockey puck. This bar of soap comes in a five ounce puck. And the soap itself came wrapped in plastic with this little cardboard display around it. Now it's supposed to smell like cedar and seaweed. However, I don't know what seaweed smells like, so I couldn't exactly tell you if that's what it smells like or not. However, what I can tell you is that the ingredients list says that it has some juniper wood extract. And to me, I definitely smell a little bit of that. Along with some cedar in there as well. Now it does have a little bit of a perfumey scent to it, however, it's not bad and it's not like it smells like it would be like a woman's soap. To me it smells like a very nice scented aftershave. Now when you're using this in the shower, it definitely fills the whole shower with that scent. It's got a lot of stuff in it that I'm not really even going to try to say, but a few of the things that stick out to me is that it's got shea butter, which is really nice to help moisturize your skin. It's got jojoba oil in it. It's got some palm kernel oil in it. It's got a few different things in there that are really good for the skin and leaves the skin feeling nice and soft. Now for all that stuff to actually work, you've got to get all that grime and all that dead skin off of yourself. And Puckett does a good job of getting rid of all that using volcanic sand or volcanic ash. I really liked it because I really felt like I was scrubbing myself clean because I could feel those little pieces of sand rubbing on my skin sometimes. Pucket also has activated charcoal in it, which helps cleanse and neutralize any scents that are currently on you, as well as gives the soap and its lather a dark grayish tint. And from what I can tell from the ingredients on the back, it doesn't look like there's anything too horrible in it that stuck out to me like I wouldn't want to use the soap at all. Now I do have to say I did enjoy this last month and a half or so of using the Pucket it really leaves you feeling clean and even several hours after I still feel clean and fresh out of the shower. Now the one thing that I wish that they would change about this soap and it's not even actually the soap itself or the packaging. It's actually it's price tag. It comes in at about $15 which I wish that that was a little bit lower and a little bit more affordable. However, I really do like this soap, and honestly, I think that if you can afford it, it's definitely worth the $15. So if you want to try out Gibbs Pucket, definitely make sure you head up that link down below. If you like this review, please make sure to give me a big thumbs up down below, hit that subscribe button, hit that bell so that you're notified whenever I put out a video, and I want to know what soap you are currently using. Until next time, you all have a good one.